Hello and welcome back to another YouTube King Skyline tutorial. Today we're going to be looking at Daisy Tools. We are going to be looking at packing our mod, signing our mod and uploading it to Steam. Okay, so today we're going to be using um, my mailbox test from an earlier video. If you wish to see that video, I will leave the card in the description. Or, or no, I will leave uh, the link in the card above. Okay, so, building the mod. We should somewhat semi-know how to do this by now. If not, here we go. So, this is Daisy Add-on Builder. Uh, personally, I use this and not Makiro. That's because I've not learned how to use Makiro. So, this is the way it's going to be. Basic tools. So, you're going to want this set up just like I have right here. So, keep your temp folder the same. You path to your project folder, just leave that as your P drive, set your author, and I will leave this in the description for you. Um, so we have our mod folder, and now we need to build a folder for the actual mod to go in. Um, so we'll create a new folder and we'll go at YouTube video okay happy dizzles and in that folder we'll create another folder called add-ons and another folder called keys don't create this keys folder if your uh, mod's going to be a private mod this is just if you generally want it as a public mod so now we've got this we can actually set the add-on builder up. So change these top one to your mod folder. So for me, this will be mailbox test and we'll take the parent folder. So it takes everything with it. Um, and we want our output folder to be the folder that we just made. So YouTube video and make sure we click add-ons for this one. So it should say at YouTube video, dash add-ons right um, if this is going to be your final version or a version you're uploading to steam make sure to click binarize textures and make sure binarize and extended login is on I'm not going to binarize these textures because it's just a test and then click pack and then hopefully this packs our mod with no problems build successful happy days we now have a PBO of our mod. So if we go to YouTube video, we can see in the add-ons that we have Millbox test PBO. Now we're going to want to open DS Utils. And you can add your source directory through this. What I would just like to do is drop my PBO in there. For you, you're not going to have a key. So you're on this key section you're going to hit N and it will bring this new box up. So we're going to create a new key. So this one will be YouTube video and make sure your destination path is somewhere where you actually know and will remember. So we'll create this key. It's important to protect my key. Yep, I know. And now we can click process says here one file successfully signed and we can see that we now have YouTube video by sign as well in the folder so now we can close DS utils so if you're going to want to make this a public mod you are going to want to put your key in here so you will need to find your key wherever you just stored it so keys we have YouTube by private key and YouTube video dot by key. So your private key is the one that you should keep yourself. You never give this out to anyone. This is the one that you can use to carry on signing your mods. 
the, just the YouTube video by key is the one that you're going to want to either put in your private server or put in your keys folder in your mod for other people to use. So I can close these down. Hopefully you're still with me. Shouldn't be too bad. Um, now I will come over to Publisher. So we've got Daisy Publisher here. And the first thing I like to do is go straight and select my mod. So we'll go to our P drive, select YouTube video, the whole folder, the whole parent folder, and it should say all signed. It should give us a name up here. So for this, we'll just quickly change this to YouTube video test. Give it any tags if needed, animation, provide any links if needed. Uh, your visibility. I'm going to set this as a private one. And you're going to want mod. Give yourself a nice description. This mod is for a video. Hit I agree with Steamworks, and you can go for uh, your own image here. So we'll just quickly select an image. Ch -ch 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 skyline there we go publish that is now this mod going onto the steam workshop and available for everyone to use and see and download this may not publish anytime soon my internet speed is not the best right now um still waiting for my actual internet to be installed so i'm currently using dongle one of those little um internet grabby things so once your item is successfully published Go back to your item in the publisher and make sure you select the parent folder for the mod again and in your change notes if you want to change notes I, I always like to generate dot cpp just so I know that I've done it and then hit update Spelled generate wrong look. Oh dear. So once this pops up, I'm going to try and load the website to see the actual mod on the Steam page. Let's mute that. And there we go. The mod is now currently on Daisy Workshop. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed and I hope this video was actually quite useful. Have fun, guys.